Well, it took me about 15 minutes to get my Amazon delivery from the P1 level. Then the damn security guard stopped me and wouldn't let me back upstairs. Luckily, I had my ID with me, which I was about to leave in the damn room, and I would have been stuck down here. These assholes. But they have some kind of way to check to see if people have already been admitted into the fucking hospital. This shit just pissed me off. That's what happened when you order stuff to the damn hospital. It was a long ass line that I had to stand in to get back in. Three. Then I was like, I might as well get my breakfast while I'm down here, but I left my money upstairs. So now, still going back up here. But the good thing is, they said Cadence can go back to the other um, less intensive care unit today. So I'm just trying to get ready to go down there. I have to wash some bottles of my hungry ass. Miss breakfast by five minutes. Got my baby in here. She, at least she looked comfortable. I don't want to wake her back up. She was cracking out earlier. Uh-oh. Mommy is so tired today. I have not gotten any sleep. Gotta feed a baby every two hours. I ain't even unwrapped my hair today. I was reading her this nice little Nick U book still and she fell asleep. So, hopefully she stays asleep when I put her down. Cause you know how Kayla's like to wake up when you put her down. She's like, uh-uh, who moved me? So mommy tired. I wanna go to sleep too. And mommy can't sleep while I'm holding you cause I might that's a little drop you or something. Uh oh. She said, You talking about putting me down? Found it outside. It's beautiful. She finally getting some rest. Oh my god, thank god. Now mommy can get rest. I had to turn her oxygen up to 100. Her levels is looking better. That's her at the top with the 156 blood. I mean, heart rate, 100% blood pressure, 56 respiratory rate. 